remains. When we practice EDG, like two Blades weeks ago or something. Shields will oh, okay. We things off on breeze. Denji on defense, heretics on attack. That's not what you want to hear if you <laughs> support heretics. Into the drone gets cancelled out by the shock start. Last time they played it was two weeks ago. And I imagine the fact that they had to do some kind of change up meant that it didn't go great. Yeah, lovely from Denji as well. I like that they changed their normal style of play all the way over towards left. No one on site. Normally Astro plays on site, but they changed it up for the pistol. Yeah, they gave up all of that A space, but they were not afraid to fight that backside area as a team, as a unit. Lakia just lining up the shots right here. A job well done for the side of Genji to start things off. Those are big moments that you want to get on the board early on. You know, we often talk about this, Trey. It's a, it's a marathon. It's not yeah, a and These are things where you're start calling this the Gen G by maybe. The depth of your strategy book can potentially get exposed. Texture's the one who's getting tested right oh. now. Plucking Root out of the sky. And of course, dipping in for a second, perhaps a third. But wisely decides to take a step back. <laughs> he had to get no, uh, get no tags here. He was an imminent threat already. Not landing every shot he's taking, but just the pressure alone. Making heretics have to yeah, I can't believe he's down. full HP on that, to be honest. It's enough of a threat. We saw a texture with the Marshal. You see a Guardian for Meteor and Charon as well. Silent creep up all around the mid area of the map. Once contact gets made in this mid door, that's going to be the key for Boo to creep on up. I take them out. And creep into his death. Yeah, really and it's kind of just who down. gets the Ecos here, really. Who gets close to their role? Options right now for the side of heretics. Not at all. Yeah, they have all the mid space, so at least they'll have some info of how Genji like to play some of these default setups and three twos for future anti ecos. As hey, I that's that, uh, insane, insane double dink. Dude, they're gonna get a plant. Maybe does this guy get to this angle? Yeah, they get a plant. Guardian on the other side. Can heretics convert on this? Can they close to window? Oh, oh. no plant. Is getting caught, the spike not going to go down. Patek's classic, the only thing standing between Genji and a second uh -oh. win. Uh oh, you want to die here? It's a big ass early on. And there's just no way for Patek to get this. He's not even going to be able to get to the spike in time. He's, He's not going to be able to get it. <laughs> he needs to die. <laughs> yeah, that's a good way to make him swing. It wasn't but. the way he wanted to go, but he will go down. So Genji, get their second. Salvation for Gen G. That was a nice round from Heretics to do a lot of damage. They actually did way more damage than I thought. The, the little things that are going to take us the distance, Doug. They give the kill to Lakia there. With that Sheriff now, look at his ultimate. Viewers can't see it yet, but he has five ult orbs online. He's only three away from that Hunter's Fury. There you Extra. Go. Gets dropped the orb, uh, the orb from Lakia. For the first so a big investment into this one. We got to look over towards A. That's where the op is holding. The nice info over towards short. Your insta takes the TP, and that is a shot and a half. These openers from Gen G look so good right now. Picks everywhere on the map, left and right. That operator got online too, and yet again a five v three. Oh, it's looking to double dip. Benji Fishy posted up on half wall. Jesus. This is their first buy, getting annihilated. Oh my god, they only did... Not the best start. When you imagine that you're playing for a grand final, this is not how you envision it to start. Nerves can definitely be a factor in high pressure moments like this. Oh god, he's got a save. That's what we're seeing right now, just from the start of Heritage. No way. Individually, one by one. We get the 40 second save. They will get 3,000. Texture and you get a better round than this? Not really. Everyone's then, surviving. As well, just the solo peaks. B main after after. That's one. a lot of money. It's dropping like flies. Thirty seconds left. And so Benji Fishy now just has to sit by. Yeah, I wouldn't even be hunting. Man, Open fourteen play, HP. I'm not even hunting. Conclusion without being detected. Accepting it, and this is sick. Into the next round. But they're on the prowl. They're hunting him. I mean, if he can get a kill without doing and it. Because their economy is going to be flourishing no matter what. If he can what, get a kill with uh. Here comes first contact. Bloodhounds with nose to the ground, trying to hunt him down. 
Yeah, there we go. No one goes down. It's a giant, a giant round. There really is. Just dialed in is Gen G right now. Shout out to, uh, to the Yori there as well, not overextending, making sure he didn't die to keep their econ good. Like everything at the moment here was so nice. Found him and then Yori literally just played his life to wait for his teammate to get the kill. Uh, Monkey underscore enjoyer, thank you for the whole year, bro. Thank you, thank you. And hey, name, right? Do I say it? Thank you so much. Oftentimes, putting together plays that almost don't look real, that almost look like they're they're defying the way the game is played. Challenging convention. You expect for Her if heretics are going to have a really good shot at this. Three passing on site because of Yoru. They want to fast go against the Yoru, honestly. Whoa! Wait, no way! No way! He hit the guy at the back. There's no way he hit the other guy. That is so unlucky, bro. Yeah. But what was that shot from texture? No, oh, he, he missed the, the shot and then he hit the, the, side, the guy behind the wall. Somebody else instead. I think it was Rians with a wall bang. You take what you can get, right? <laughs> I mean, 100%. Come Prius, let's give us a good replay for this one. I'll take a look at that play one more time. Look at this. This was ridiculous. Oh my god. Oh wait, did he actually I count your lucky stars? Just obliterated the opposition and meteor as well. Seven and two right now. Excellent start. A timeout but he kind of, he kind of flicked to the right. Again, a dreadful start to the situation. And Gen G, now, now I've seen that in slow mo. I don't know. It kind of looked like it was on, on purpose. And he, and it's he like saw that really other guy the fast. First map every now and then. Yeah, slow starts every time. But they just went full steam ahead, with no signs of stopping. They found out what the problem was. They fixed it. And they're vibing right now. For the side of Heretics, I imagine their coach is just telling Either them, Either way, guys. rough, rough start. Second by though, for uh, Heretics coming in. Take a deep breath. It's not they gotta over. go up against, uh, I mean, a Gen G that already has four rounds. And I'm, I'm being fully honest, they only need four rounds for their attack. And they have unreal amounts of money. Through their ults, but... I mean, it's been a dreadful start so far. We'll yeah. see how things look on the other side of this timeout. Jet fly safe. Will be the second gun round for Heretics. And they need this one bad, Doug. They need this one really bad. Meteor's getting active already, taking so much space. Going fast Meteor against Yoru again. Yoru is to take the DP from short. And Yoru is just spammed Meteor one through the, the smoke. Just the right just some spam through the smoke, seeing some of the chasers on the other okay. end. But Munchkin, he gets plucked out. Wait, by that how? Dart. Was that Molly? Where do they go off? Was that of Molly or was that spam? They don't really have space anywhere on the map. Meanwhile, you look at the mini map. Texture's already taken caves. You reckon there's Molly on top? Dial in on this angle. Kind of sick. Of early info here. You imagine a jump spot coming through from the side of Heretics, or they just swing into it. They swing in. Surely they'll get taken out. Got to find out right now. Texture is Meteor always is here. The yeah, the and they spot. find him on that jump spot, and they show. know that he's aggro. And now they think twice about it. This is a brutal spot for heretics. They know that the Yoru just ulted on B. They've already gotten picked off on the other side. You know there's an off towards A. Much like we saw in the pistol round, right? There's not a lot of safe space. Safe space. Thirty here. seconds. Only one person on B though. Right Texture does have. Uh, sorry, Lucky does have recon. Lucky uses his recon clothes. Really? Good on. Lucky with an opportunity to make a massive play. Meanwhile, Texture on the other side. He was overwhelmed, but Meteor again delivers. Roots left in a one v two with ten seconds left. He's got the spike in the hand. He's got to commit. Yeah, to and he's kind of got to stick to this. Five HP. Nothing but a sliver, nothing but a little bit of spray will take you down. Looking to Damn, find some NG on this one, nice. The recon went deep and then obviously got shot Flows early and then they could just insta rush over Beautiful towards the site. They ended up having three people to pretty much shoot Meteor in front of the wall. The entry once more on that Go map two? Yeah, this is too many for them. Viper the, their comp is so good on attack. I mean, you're just stuck. You want to run into Texture's operator. He's going to take you out too. I mean, look at that. It's just the tracers. On to Benji Fishy. 
And that's not the first time we see him do that. Oh, okay, yeah. Molly on the... Dude, that's nice, though. Molly, uh, Molly out to the box and then goes to the cubby. That was a cool combo. dominating the server right now. And we expect a Texture to be the guy, right? We talk so much about Texture and how he's going to be the answer to Wood and who's going to be able to challenge this, this kid and... It's Meteor and, who's just yeah, this is the show. problem. This texture is just Playing holding a main, a main control all the time. So they definitely have to push this guy off over towards a main. Ember, Ember27, thank you so much, man. Appreciate the, the two months. Clip is one for the books. I don't think Genji are interested in reading it, though. Look at Munchkin again, getting active. And again, it's Meteor who capitalizes. More than halfway to his ult again. It's an unbelievable performance so far for the guy. Just, uh, he just he had is, three. look at him. Two. And Her another disadvantage for Heretics. They're down two members once more, Doug. Yeah, and they need to find a way to get some sort of success going, get some confidence going. Maybe it's in the hands of Woot, but something to kind of get yourself out of these, these stumbling blocks that you've slammed into every single round so far. Yeah, I mean, that was a lovely uh, recon. Texture showing that he can do a bit of his own. The blades come online, and Woot falls. Is this guy still alive? Classic at that distance, excuse me, a sheriff. Maybe he can deal a little bit of damage, but not even that. A 6-0 lead for Genji. Heretics have already called a timeout. Oh, and when do they use it over timeout? Best woot in that jet they kind of have a, had a better idea here, though. They pushed the op off over crazy. towards Texture A. Had the updraft still. Woot didn't have his. But still, moments There's like always that a chance of this happening, though, on Breeze, right? Yeah, considering considering what you said, if, if you don't play it Beautiful. that much as well. Nice control, nice the nice um nice the double nice map pick nice the double map bans for them is like huge against you guys right just now we're seeing him flip the map. yeah he's gonna up and be we get info there we weren't sure he's, what they're gonna ban now second. enabled yeah he's same it, it was binder icebox the duo that. in tandem just switching yeah. sites switching positions i'd be scared of him too especially with this little off angle he's holding i think there was also a slight jump right and banning split i know they play it but they don't like playing it Oh, okay. In the halls they haven't played the it once this tournament know, either. At least they have a better understanding of what's on the other side. Wu wasn't able to find anything going with the blades. Maybe the op will tell a different story. So the way that I look at this, and I mean this in the utmost respect, is that you in theory lose Breeze and Ascent, and then you got three maps that are like pretty close. But they're like the maps that you value, mustn't drop. Mid, that's be the in this yep. round. And that makes sense. Oh, yeah. There's like, like 3 50 50 maps, two maps that you have a big disadvantage on. That's pretty much where I'm at. I think it was fairly accurate, yeah. They've got plenty of money, but I can't imagine Texture goes for a 1v5. I mean, their ascent has a lot of like, like they're very good the, with their ascent in terms of like their protocols and stuff. But carry that into the next round. I'm way more confident on Ascent than I am Breeze against these guys, so we'll, yeah. we'll see what actually happens. And they're in a tough spot right now because you want to hunt. It's a 5v1, but if you drop all your weaponry right now, you're not going to have much left in the tank. You're going to have a scrappy buy, Wait, light armor. Is Death, is Death still here? Yeah. I can, I, dude, not that, so not that I'm going to pre-fire or anything because I don't want to get banned off my own channel, but... Losses. but kind of feel it in the air a little, little bit. bit active. You've got the dart that just hit back sight from Rien's. I just Make did. Sure I'm, just, I'm just saying. Also I'm also just saying. It, it feels a little bit. It just feels kind of right, bro. You woke up at 5 a.m. This big. Every dollar counts. Six one. And I don't think texture knows. It's tough when you have so many angles. You have to clear. Oh. Of course he knows. Guess is it just the right time? So Benji fishy falls, but heretics on the board. They got around and they did so their own way. They got. I tell you what though. Really anything That's crazy. some good they ults. Their individual fights on different areas across the map. That bodes well. Yeah, it was a slow and controlled round from them. It was the dog through halls. Yeah, and I think the the, the attack op makes sense, but the attack op. I don't know. Boo getting picked. Fight, that was his first kill of the round. So you're 100 percent correct. The fan favorites. They take the first round for themselves. Wait, they go aggro? What is this? Genji still with the Kozu lead and op still in the hands of Texture. Wood has his own. Way more aggressive this time around. Double pass and holding window goes to aggro. And then even if that's yeah, clear, and you can't really overstep too much. Wants the rifle to shoot at. And the toggle's right on cue. And the thing is, Doug, 
This is great from uh, Gen G as well. It's just like the pressure of one smoke being over towards A main and the fact they've been up in this the whole time just makes them scared of it. You also gotta think, like, why would they smoke themselves up if the op is here? But the op could be anywhere in this box. That's the issue. Seekers into Sova ult's pretty strong. If they decide to go A, they're gonna have to reckon with the two Astro Stars that are sitting at their feet. I've got your trail. But the Seekers invested, the wall goes up, and they've decided this is where they want to dance. This is where they want to try oh, to find boy. success. Locky with the Hunter Siri out, it's gonna be traded. On oh my god, the, the two Sovas locked onto each other. Still trying to dance oh, you are so wrecked. You did unbelievable to get a kill. Now going through the door, a texture stuck Whoa. on the outside. 30 HP, giant 2v2. And now a 2v2 as the spike goes down. That flash is so good. Munchkin has to wait for Texture to join the party. Got Heretics. He's so Need this round. No armor. They cannot get reset here. Heretics huh? in a really nice spot here, digging their heels into the site. <laughs> but with such little health. One what can Genji do? Munchkin falls. That's the weak one that's left. Yeah, I might have to save. Does anyone swing the op? Yes, okay. It does, it there we go. All we have to do is talk about it. Death Spear will good. Two rounds in a row. Two in a row? Not bad. And they decided Let's see what else they got. Utility. Seekers, dog. Dark comes out. Even the late drone that they still had from Rian's at the end there. Yeah, and the Sobo too. Yep. <laughs> Leave my so chair for 10 minutes, I'm on timeout. That's it. That's right, I'll do it. I'll do it for the, um, the in between the maps. Coming back into the hands of Pad Attack, swinging into the Oppa Texture, who has been an absolute freak this map so far. Signs of life for Heretics. And now they're reading the map really well. Boo is doing a good job of IG yelling. Uh, Insta Molly goes out, wanted to try and Molly the drone. Got a TP aggro into this corner. There's no way he ever takes that. Recon is all at A. It means that the op goes back to here. And yeah, every time we've had this from Gen G, it's had success. An op holding here has led to them winning six rounds. Well, obviously, they didn't have the gun for the pistol. We you guys get what I mean. Goes for an off angle this time instead of the normal angle. does a really good job of prep. Find some cover texture. They're looking for you. And that's info gathered that the op is confirmed at A main. He's not pushed off of that line though. Oh. Whoa. And he gets dropped by Rians. That's a I'd huge kill. Yeah. yeah, Prius. Again, heretics. <laughs> <laughs> okay, question mark yeah, over, to question mark over towards A. Surely he doesn't take his TP and a there is a three-person stack here. The they feel like the question mark on A time. is really, really strong. And we still got a recon for Lakia, and it's going to go on the back wall, and they're going to have to 180 it. Here comes the recon, and no one can go through. Jesus. Yeah, it's a nice stack in the end from Denji. What was that for Meteor? The run and gun on the first kill. The insta lock on the head. Here's the second. He's here to win it all, man. This is unlucky, man. It's a big pick. Careful, though. Yeah. Oh, I'm not sure what Meteor's going to do with B, though. Showing that he can wield the op as well. Not sure what's saying. You will get to seven. I'm not sure what Meteor's want to go towards B, though. 14 and 6. Yeah. A second Yoru ult online and available. Oh. Here's that entry. Oh my gosh. Texture didn't even stand a chance. But the thing is, once you see the Yoru TP the there, you gotta know that the Yoru is doing it from B, up. right? Yeah. And then Meteor pushing all the way through. I mean, you've killed the aggressive Smelling jet who's naturally off the angle. You can expect someone on A fight, sure, but. They're not gonna be like re aggressing too much towards A main. I feel like it's kind of obvious. Maybe it wasn't obvious. Maybe they play around it was obvious that the uh, eighth fight was weaker. That's just so tough when What's you the timing on this result, It's such a good counter to that. Oh. Uh, train oh. and shot delivered. He saw the other guy as well. Oh, oh my, second. that is pretty impressive. Dash to all mine. Halfway through. Heretics again have the door slammed in their guy faces. keeps one tapping him though. Continues to push. And it's just a freeze to the round. Bro, don't do it. Don't be doing it. Not in the final. Surely not. But he's gonna be met 
by the force of Lakia. Does he wait for his teammates to come up mid-door? He's quietly put together a really nice map so far. Oh. Rian's getting close. Yeah, these two the play off each other so well, aren't they? Boo not allowed to get into the site. As the door gets toggled once more. They have found yeah, some and Yoru just gives them still haven't gotten the main objective a lot down. of info. That's a big swing up from wait. Lakia Falls. Can he find anything big else? Big guilt. Oh, man. Oh, honestly. What a shot from Karen. Oh. Another three gets out as well. Chat eight is way too. Chat four was too many. Four was too many for defense. Eight, way too many. There was a distraction again for Gen G. They make you look at so many different angles as you're entering. The observers didn't believe, yeah, not at all. In the beginning, Meteor got contact from the tunnel, sent the clone up while Texture was holding his elbow the entire time. And at the end here, Caron, the spray control, looking so good. We haven't talked about him a ton, but he's putting up. A really nice performance as well. Everyone on the side of Genji is delivering, and that's it's such a hard timeout because it's like, what do you even, what do you even say on this one? Of the map in round eleven. I feel like A splitting is weak mind, after you push off the this jet. This isn't a map that heretics play often, and when they do, it's I mean, so I think it's hard. Like, you can't really go fast because of the Yoru. Normally run, but they have to go for the jet here because they have who has been. I mean, absolutely. Second timeout. I mean, they gotta, they gotta do a timeout because they need, they literally. Why is this always so big? They so need four rounds. They kind of needed eight rounds, in my opinion, but, but the sky, it's not getting as much value they don't have that. As I'm sure Heretics thought it would get going into this matchup, going into this series. Keep in mind, it I don't think this is a crazy hard time. Got some things cooked up on the defensive side. Like I don't, e I don't even know like how you're meant to do this stuff against this team. Really. The, uh, I, I love that breeze. I mean, it's so strong. I mean, that guy might be right, In my opinion, a weak so uh, a, a split is like the one, but. Genji look incredible. I think we've got yeah, I'm definitely looking forward to going towards it. And I mean, like, you, you can also pressure tubes super easily because they're always watching that, which means that I keep eyes away from like heavier towards it. So, yeah, I'd probably look at doing towards that. But... So they go for a uh, flash on short to get info into an, into an insta drone. Any rush off the barrier. They need 13, and that is actually true. All the way in the back of B site, so if it is, if they do actually commit, and he can be there, there could be a third member there. As all that's happening, Lakia gets info on Benji Fishy and Halls. A triple shock dart bounce. That's not something you see every day. No, I thought he thought that one in for like dot two or something, and it just bounced back. He's got the angles down, the geometry. Heretic's quietly leaning towards A. Remember, Texture has his op. And it's looking that way. Another opportunity for him to strike. Yeah, it's nice though. The it's this, this right? More. Someone needs to break his dart. A quick step back. Fox the dash. The flash through. Meanwhile, who's the one that falls? Texture yeah, and they gotta do again. way more pressure at mid and the entire door. Time. That's a dumb one. Genji are obliterating heretics on this. I, I was worried that this might happen on, the setups, they're just on Breeze in the sun. So bright right now for Gen G. A smoke comes out in main off the dog. There's a suck to follow up. Nobody from Heretics can come out and support Woot, who just dashed onto site. There's a dart behind them as well that allows everybody back site to just get some free kills. I mean, it's just too hard to entry against a comp like this. You have to try to bait out some of this Astro utility early on. Maybe catch him on a cooldown. Maybe catch him so he doesn't have that suck available or the stun. And just like that, Meteor is slowly creep or Texture is slowly creeping up to Meteor's score. 16 kills for Meteor, 14 for Texture. As they're going to go gonna fast, and the Yoru is just going to take this TP. They've now got three people on site. site. Meteor is here to support. Munchkin has gotten so much value here as well. I mean, forget about the and they, duo. And they have the, have the cross map recon. Like, it's just the so can much. Provide, the Karen can provide another kill found. Patatek and Boo have to try to make something of this. One enemy but remaining. they've got them cornered. They've got them Spike surrounded. They know where they are. They're Jesus. on the hunt. Genji gets well, to 10. And on their worst half, in theory, Firing statistically. Every single member what can we say? We've got Meteor on 17. This, it was up to the this guy is the having the Meteor best tournament I've ever to. seen him have. Yeah, didn't have to do much there. Kara, I, I would actually, you know what I'd love to see? All of Meteor's like tournament stats and then this like on its own. I would like the improvement in just this one tournament is crazy.
right now. He had a pretty good split too, but I mean split one, sorry. I'm from Gen Z Sports. I mean, maybe he has a good split too. Two가 로터스를 굉장히 좋아하는 맵인 걸 알고 있었고, 그리고 굉장히 좋은 전적이 있었던 맵이었기 때문에 픽을 했었던 것 같고요. 저희는 네 예상을 했었고, 네 저희의 이제 로터스를 다시 제대로 보여줬던 차례가 됐었던 것 같습니다. G2 전에 상대가 매우 따라오는 게 힘들었었는데 이번에는 그런 일 없도록 저희가 더 신경 써서 잘하고 네, 저희의 퍼포먼스를 더 보여드리겠습니다. It would seem as G2 look to keep themselves in this half. Bunch can find two quick kills, however. Suddenly starts answering back. Two rifles in play. Wide swing out. No way. Taken down. Bunch can find one. Hunter's fury out. I see the tap on. Bunch get on the swing. Bails them out. 테르틱이 현재 제 기준에서는 결승에 올라갈 것 같은 팀중 하나고요. 선수들이 굉장히 잘한다고 느끼고 있고, 네, 그리고 저희랑 아직 붙어보지 않았으니까 결승에서 한번 좋은 경기 펼쳤으면 좋겠습니다. 많은 NG post spawn on this map. NA, yeah. 그리고 중국까지 this, 이제 this is the thing with their attack comp. Like... Their after plant is so so strong they can just play off of sight, which means that you need to speed up on a map that is like a fast rotate. So that's not great. So you need to like as soon as the plant goes down, yeah, pretty much have to instantly just like even disrespect the viper wall or just send it in. And then you have the pressure of them playing off sight after plant. Astra can be anywhere. Viper Molly. You're good. <laughs> they can also just play on site. So they could literally just disregard all of that and you're rushing into the site and there's just five people holding the site. So just the pressure of the fact that you know that after plant is insanely strong, they can play off site. It just means that you have to like send it into sites early and they, there could be like five people here. There could be five or there could be zero and you have no idea. This is where they thrive on this attacking side. Of Breeze. Yeah, and they're in to get in some Euro. Orb. Call such a good game here with, with the Orb Astra. early. You'll see them deny Pressure over towards eight. In the mid round, usually. Sure. And slow starts like this, always. This is, the, this is the bread and butter for them. Yeah, Pat Attack invested the dog at the beginning of the round, spotted where Karen was. And it seems like Chenji want to lean back into it anyway, knowing that. They've been spotted on some of the presents. I love this call. You make the Viper Wall go up A. It suggests a split going through double doors. He might even put his body on the line to sell the damn thing. Benji Fishy falls, but look at where the spike is. Look at where the rest of Gen G are. All attention turning towards B. They're going to waltz in, and Munchkin might win the round by Yeah, it's like a one-person fake with a recon foul. over towards A. He's a man on a mission. No one can connect on him. He's like Neo. And now he just holds bottom mid by himself. It's a nice round you're, though. You're right. Give him he 100% won the round by himself. But either way, the macro game went in favor of Genji this entire round. What can Boo and Reans do to consolidate, do anything? But Munchkin with four, the IGL. Maybe. Hey. Not able to deliver on the ace. What a gift that would have been. But Lakia cleans it up. Genji oh, gets going to be short. Heretics not finding Heretics. Really anything else. I mean, they can't really either. force into it, but you might just see it. For team Heretics. I mean, their aim isn't even there right now. They need to just start getting any type of rounds they can. Any type of gun duels. I mean, it was really cool, though. This cross map, sure. uh, this cross map draw. recon into one pass and fake. With the sure. Sheriff, it could be so powerful. I mean, two body shots. He gets a headshot there through the wall. But either way. Munchkin set that round up perfectly. He really did. The call was exceptional. The execution was somehow even sweeter. Yeah, I mean, the idea was unbelievable. Uh, we'll keep an eye on this during the whole best of five as well. 2 0 for Genji. What a clash that would be. Loot is currently sitting at 4 and 12 or something like that. Meanwhile, Texture and Meteor, we've sung their praises so many times. The song has got to be like a leaky faucet in the minds of heretics but they might be able to close this thing at least this round they've got a pretty big numbers advantage lucky and meteor are the only two alive they've dealt with one of this two-headed beast in texture but meteor still healthy now taking some damage and bro we'll get cleaned up by woot leaving lucky alone a guardian but the nice round sure way too big of an ask let's see what guns they managed to get got a guardian got another guardian 
Oh, it's an actual... This is nice. Double Guardian. Rians did unbelievable. Though. That first kill was everything, and then positioning for the second kill was great. That allows Woot to come in with that Marshall, just get a bunch of tags on players, make it actually a fair fight for players that are using the Sheriff. All of a sudden, all you need to do is get a body shot. Shut down. Hit a couple there. Yeah. That was a nice one. It's big for Woot. It's big for Heretics. We actually got this. <laughs> okay. The well, vibes are still good, so if you're a yeah, fan out they're there, feeling it. Which I'm sure there are many and plenty. It's not too dim, not too gloom. Maybe they Flash into recon. Song. That's nice. The recon goes deep, so it plays uh, left and right. It's the same dog we saw from the previous round. Into the dog to set up the guy to short. Info there is. Has to be really careful about trying to get out now. You know he's gonna have to. Brain's got tagged, I guess, with the marshal. Not really feeling safe about it. it. As all this is happening, there's been a complete walk down through middle. They're all here. Bunch kid can't settle the shots with the sheriff. Decent damage done. So a little worse for wear. 3 2 1 an elbow doesn't get much info. Benji just missing the timing, maybe for good reason. But Meteor's God, good that reason is a shot. Yeah, it doesn't expect away. the it doesn't expect the other there, but that was a lovely like shot, man. Jesus. Oh, he's tagged him. I wonder if he can hit the spam. No, Camera spotting sick. two, spotting three. Utility cleared, but space gained from Genji. Spike planted. And these are the scary moments when Genji Extra gets with a guardian. And Texture has this Guardian. He can really activate. 14 to 5. They're down in numbers, they're down in weapons, but this is winnable. It's going to be big on Heretics to execute. Shot, man. Trade it back as Boo falls. Oh, this is big. A flash in the face. Texture can't respond back. Lock here with the ghost. That was nice. Oh, they did a good amount of damage, really, considering so by uh, Genji. Continuing to stick around. Yeah, making it costly. For Team Heretics and Gen G, they're very comfortable doing these anti-eco slow rounds where they like to feel out the map, and it's all because it paints a better picture for Munchkin later on in the half. You're gonna see him pull out all the stops in a match like this. This is it, this is the final. They wanna take this first map win, get the momentum in their favor completely, and the best way to do that is completely decimating your opponent on your map pick. Oh, they have so many options. If you're heretics here, you know so they're taking we'll aim in. A bit active, get online. This last couple of rounds, couple nice Yo, shots. One, two, three. People one away. Here. Now train day. Here. And of course, that's where Genji's headed. We get the up like. and an off angle. Well, I say off angle. Kind of a normal you know, angle, but. Who's next? Oh boy. Yeah, it's better than any dart you could possibly ask for, because who can find a timing? Because he saw through. Oh, has to dash away. I thought he was going to try to. That actually shot. worked out really well. Gets punished for the high ground. He tries taking. Meteor so it far kind of worked here. out pretty well at the moment for Heretics. Like, it didn't look disastrous and they used a Yoru And normally for this team, that it's like a free win of a round. But they've gotten the spike down, and as you mentioned in the previous round, this is where Gen G are successful. They're so dead. This is where they're at their best. Spam through the smoke. Boo falls as well. Bro, Meteor is farming. Benji, Fishy, and Woot have to force back to try to get this 2v5. Jesus. Someone take him down, man. Possible situation. So many things to consider. So many targets to find. Just too many. Gen G map point. Yeah, we got eight chances. Is an absolute animal right now. He's Doug. insane, bro. Running and gunning, taking every timing he knows he can take. Off of the drone here. Didn't even need to see him. He heard the, the audio cue. The sidestep. He keeps getting. He keeps getting move, <laughs> running kills as well. Three on the round and. He's just close range jewel and everyone. He was the one that opened up that entire round. He 21 to 8. Mid, while all that commotion was going on at A main, that Yoruwalk getting all this info. Karen cut off the rotations. No cavalry could be arrived. Lakia has this all Munchkins close to his. Those two alone, I mean, <laughs> those two can secure the map. Yeah. This drone will get the info on the Woot as well to, to secure that orb. If they want, they're a little wary though, for good reason. They know they have gun advantage into this round. 
you know heretics have to force up whatever they can and these close range fights that's where the main the drone to middle they can expect so some kind of peek yeah? from the side of Rians in the mid didn't really get any type of info and Genji are more than willing to just wait for all the utility of heretics to be thrown another flash shoes not getting any info Patrick, hey, info for info space. Three people on site for heretics though. Not that they have guns. Well, they have the they have guns, but not the best guns. What the? Dude, he got the second guy there. Bro, how how does how are Stingers doing this? Oh, it's definitely too late. But how are Stingers doing this? Can't help but feel like it is, Doug. But good work from Patatek slashing down. The two players in A main with that stinger. I talked about how EU stinger, the rare EU gun. stinger, actually working. And he played it to near perfection. Look at this replay right here. <laughs> Again, it's a double lineup. That's more than ideal when you're running that gun. For sure. You gotta settle it just enough, and he did that. So satisfying when it hits like that. Pad attack close to his ult. Big one too, as you think about how Genji liked to play at the beginning of these rounds. Any info that you can gather is valuable. Decoy. It's a faster approach from Genji. Oh no, not again. Back for quite a bit of rounds. <laughs> Meteor, I mean, he's so disrespectful right now, and I don't blame him. Oh my god. Oh no, it's a team flash. Okay, it's all good. Both souls almost caught in their utility, but Lock is the one that falls. And now the Seekers on the swing. Woo! Bro oh, killed an extra guy at the back here on top of that as well. That's impressive. On There's no room for Meteor to get back to the spike. At least they're getting a little bit of warm-up. And nice shots. Maybe That's maybe we start counting this down still. Six. Eight to six. Both ends, but Heretics come out on top. Pad attack the deciding factor. Yeah, he team flash woot right there. Dude, the whole iPad what? messer of the crowd yeah, is kinda sick. The follow -up kill. Poor Woot. He was like, I had him, bro. Either way, that second shot, oh my goodness. That's the move we know. And suddenly Gen G calling their first time out. Coach has some words. Wow, they to got say. a timeout out of him, okay. Maybe using their alts to combo it. Just get onto the psychic that Vipers put online. And they have so many good, that, that are going to be going into this next round. Heretics are putting quite a run into this in the closing moments of the map, or what you think would be the closing moments of the map. They seem like they were dead. I mean, they seem like they were done. But Rians has been such a good spark for this squad. And of course, with Luke getting active as well. Yeah. With Luke Just making sure. Line, yeah. Calls for hope. And when you It'll be the, hit until B off the pond or something. Like that, I mean, it's a round that you have no business winning. And you steal it away, it gives you the confidence to now build up your own economy. All of a sudden, Genji has scrapped. Bro, they got so many orbs, and they're kind of close to this as well. So, so it's literally going to be like they get the and orb, it. and then they're going to have an orb on Yoru. So next round, they're going to have so five orbs. And then that should be too much. Yeah, just making sure in this round, literally all they're doing is just trying to make sure they hold A main so they can plan ahead to have this all. Yeah, there's Yoru getting the orb. Fix it though. Whoa! Okay, honestly. Genji need to make sure that they don't overheat and use any of these orbs they want into the next round oh this could this could backfire they could also just win the, the game okay they're just gonna win the game but it, i got a little bit nervous there because like if you're heretics you're kind of like hold up i mean maybe hold up they're invested every all they've gotten info they've gotten the pit out and they're gonna rotate away And just Munchkin here. staying right here. Heretics have to keep one player there. That's why you see Boo just stuck. Like he's in mud. And now a late lurk. That can be a thorn in the side of Heretics. Benji they get a little bit of info where they've gone because of the tramps. He might catch a timing here. All these yeah, Munchkin and 4 up, HP is an absolute like nightmare. 
and get to the other side. So yeah, they're looking for the guy on 4 HP. Just like, where the hell is he gone? With a, a borderline impossible task put in their laps. Yeah, and Boots doesn't expect her. But they're so weak. There's got to be a really nice time. Ooh. Here for Munchkin. What in the world? How did Benji Fishy hit that? Boo's going to have to 1v2 here. He's got a phantom in hand, but time is so short. He's got to go, and he's got to go now. One away from the pit. Spots the first. Understands okay. where the second is. Yeah, just all the ults to oh, secure this one. The end, so I'm happy with that. Yeah. 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 I, I, dude, imagine you won that round. That would have been crazy. He's all ult to it. I was kind of believing if you won that. Yeah, I'm not happy what happened towards him in, but that is the way she was sometimes. We'll see you guys there.